breaking news. Hawaii volcano eruption, Donald Trump approves aid to those left homeless by Kyle A. E. Chaos. Donald Trump has approved a request for federal aid to assist people left homeless by the Kailaea a volcano eruption on Hawaii's Big Island. Hawaii Governor, David Ige, wrote to the president on Wednesday to ask for Washington's help for those displaced by the explosions. Since the volcano started erupting on May 3, more than 600 homes have been destroyed by the lava. It is thought many of those are the primary dwelling for people who live there. Mr. Ige's request on Wednesday stressed Hawaii had been so far dependent on charities for help. He said that state had been completely reliant on the county government, state agencies, and a large network of non profit organizations. The request asked for help from all of the federal government's assistance programs to provide funding for counseling, shelter, resolving unemployment, and legal matters. A second letter from the governor confirmed there would be a federal emergency management agency center established on the island. People affected by the eruption could register at the center so the review process for aid distribution could be started. More than a month after the eruption started, volcanic fissures were still active on Friday and the Civil Defense Agency was warning residents to take precautions. An alert on Thursday said the dangerous Fisher 8 was still producing a large channelized flow of lava into the ocean. As the lava is meeting with the ocean, it is producing a dangerous smog. Lava haze, or laze, is created when the lava hits the ocean and cools. Laze is a form of hydrochloric acid that also contains tiny volcanic glass particles. It can cause irritation to the eyes and skin, as well as breathing difficulties. Residents have been warned that the lays could also be found further away from the ocean, as it can easily travel on the wind.